Hello, my friends. To its credit, despite the depleted roster due to injuries, ORU has managed two upsets up to this point, one over Stanford, the other against Missouri. An upset tonight would be the biggest since beating Kansas three seasons ago with number 12 New Mexico in town. The scoring started with two threes from Dominique Morrison, and the Golden Eagles held the lead the entire half. Some defense here, the loose ball, ORU pounds on it. Morrison ahead to Michael Crayon with a Crayola slam, ORU by 10. Next possession, another loose ball, another steal. Ken Holman down court and the layup, ORU by 14 points. The Lobos make an 11 point halftime advantage for ORU. Uh, Hobson, three, give it to him. It was 48-37 at the intermission. Second half, the Lobos gobbled up that lead in a hurry off the ORU miss. The Morton down court, 55-55 with 10 minutes to go. But ORU regrouped big time and incredibly, despite its injuries, got its third major upset of the season. This one, the biggest of the year. The slam by four there. ORU wins it 75-66. Morrison played 38 minutes. Crayon, 36 minutes. We knew it was going to be a tough game, and they was going to make runs, and we was going to make runs. Uh, it was sort of like the MU game. They made a run. We had to make a run. We stay in their run. So that's what we had to do. We had to just keep battling. I thought Oral Roberts played really well tonight. Um, they, they executed things. They had a very good game plan. And, you know, sometimes you just got to um, you gotta shake the other guy's hand and say, job well done, and you move on. And what a great opportunity it was to be able to have a ranked team in here. It's been 13 years, I believe, 12, 13, since we had a ranked team. And you know, not a whole lot of games tonight, being two days before Christmas. Everybody who follows college basketball is going to see the scores. It's going to make it harder and harder to get guys in here <laughs> to play us. They may not want to come back. All right.